Hello everyone, welcome in Crochet Life and Stuff with Deborah. And if you saw the title, you know that it is time to continue on with Yarnivore's monthly theme. That's right. Here in the Northern Hemisphere, there's a saying, April showers bring May flowers and then pollen and mosquitoes. I'm not sure where they fit in, but you know, enough about my seasonal allergies, right? Last month, we had April showers from Miss Neva. This month, April with uh, Tool Time Adventures is bringing us May flowers. That's right. She decided to continue with the theme. So that's what we're going to do. What does this mean? Well, you'll see in the description box down below and a, a slide at the end, all of us who are participating, all of us yarnivores who will be putting up videos um, saying, yo, send me your stuff or pictures of your stuff, actually, not your actual stuff. I mean, please don't send us the things, the items. Um, and it doesn't matter if it's crochet. Yes, we are yarnivores. Here's the yarn. Some knit, some crochet, most do both. Um, I just crochet, I, knitting is magic. However, I've done other things in my creative world as well. One time somebody walked me through how to bead something in, and I did a beaded ring. This goofy thing, I've had for at least 10 years. I don't remember exactly what I made it, but look, it's kind of a flower. That would be cool if I had made it this month for this theme. I also paint sometimes, not enough. Um, whether you paint or you do beads or you do flower arranging or you sculpt or carve or do whatever you do, do paper crafting, right? Be creative be inspired by May flowers, right? And they don't have to actually be literal May flowers, but just join us, okay? For me, what I would like you to do, whatever you're making, it has to be made this month, by the end of the month, um, and send me a picture. Please put in the subject line, Yarnivores or Yarnivores Monthly Theme, so that I know it's, you know, something from you and not something trying to make whatever appendage I don't actually have longer and stronger, okay? The spam is real, y'all. Yeah. But send me a picture or pictures if you like. Do multiple projects, send multiple pictures. It's all good. But I want to hear from you. I want to see what you've made at the end of the month. I'll compile all the things I've received into a, a playlist. Not a playlist. Derp. A slideshow. Hello. Words are real too. Um, I'll make a slideshow. I'll put it up. It'll be like, yes, you know, Jane Doe made this. And John Doe made this. Maybe Jane and John know each other. I don't know. Sorry. I digress. But join us for May flowers. I will be hosting August. I don't know what August theme is yet. Hey, I don't even know what June's theme is yet. I don't remember who's hosting it. We have a whole list. We're doing the thing. We're going through all the months and we're just having some fun with it. And we hope that you will join us too. Whether you knit, crochet, paint, arrange flowers, do beading, sculpt, paint nail art, that would be cool. Oh, yes. Um, whatever it is that you do that's creative, show it to us. Let us see it, let us enjoy it. Watch all the people that are linked down below because they will be doing this as well. And um, join in on the fun and the creativity. Thank you for coming by. Thank you for taking part in the Yarnivore's monthly theme. I don't know what the hand motions are about. Again, that's apparently my interpretive dance. And um, we're going to see what kind of crazy creative things we can get done by the end of this month. Bye, y'all.